Come around this side. Come on, keep going. Good boy, let's go. <laughs> See ya! Hey everyone, my name is Mike and welcome back to Alien Isolation. The alien is no longer in our presence, we separated it from the tower. But we've got humans on the on the go now, and there's also synthetics, I think, a bit strange. But I'm sure the alien's gonna come back at some point. You know, it's not that's not the end of it, surely. So we've got a um, bunch of guys beyond these vents and stuff. That are it's, it's there we go. What's going on with the androids? I don't know. What about the change in alert status? Damn it, I don't know. I'm trying to contact Samuels. Maybe he knows what the hell Apollo is playing at. Yeah, okay, so like they just said, like, the androids are acting a bit unusual, even though they have been like that anyway. But for the first time, apparently, they're leaving their posts. So they're no longer just sitting behind trespassing zones, but they're also coming out to kill in non-trespassing zones. So what have we got here? We've got a dog tag. We've got something we can search. Here, we're maxed on all that. Just going to have a little bit of a craft here, guys, just to make sure we don't... We can pick stuff up. All right, guys. We're actually um, stocked up on a lot of... Um, Gadgets and items to use, you know, just like because we're not really using it all that much. The game doesn't force you to yet Like play a certain way There's very a lot of alternate ways to approach many scenarios So you don't always need to use flashbangs, smoke grenades, molotovs, all that shit To be honest, I've never used a single flashbang, molotov, stun button, um, smoke grenade I've never used any of them once and I've got past a lot of things without using it with, with relative ease Through trial and error, so um there we go, so here we go. These guys are now fighting against the um, synthetics. So let's let the synthetics kill them. Cause synthetics, oh god, hello. Hello. Don't link don't bring him in here. Oh you dick. He's gonna come for me now. Alright, let's make it past the thing quick. Oh come on mate. You can't tell on that quick. Oh he's trapped me in the corner. Alright, I got my shotgun equipped, so as long as we get out of this vice grip. I'm gonna shock him in the face. Ah, has he got me? We killed one of them. This is the worst fighting place to take. Ow! Let's get out of here quickly. Open the door. Open the door. Open the door. I need to heal, obviously, because my health is so low. So is he? Is he right behind me? All right, he's got some space there. So we're gonna shoot this guy in the face with the revolver because he should be nearly dead now. Oh god, he's not dead. Okay, let's switch back to the shotgun, I guess. Let's reload it as well. Nice. So weapons like these are purely used, I think, to kill synthetics. Because there's no real reason to use them against the, the alien. The flamethrower is the best weapon against the alien. Let's gonna loot these guys, see if we've got any more shotgun shells. I mean, they take a lot of bullets, obviously, but it's, um... Is that guy going down the hole? No. Right, my brain's a bit scrambled right now, taking them on. Shit. Someone just spoke. Let's reload the revolver, actually. So it's, it's, it's empty on clip ammo. Yeah, I think you need to hold square to reload it properly. Yeah. Alright, there's, there's men talking. I don't know where they are. Fire? Who's talking? There's a guy down there to the left somewhere. Is he just pointing out that the fact that there's fire in, the, in his presence? Because <laughs> shit's blowing up. So we can sprint a bit here. Oh, fuck. He's just. Someone just shot me. There we go. Here we go. This guy wants to play. He's got a shotgun. Jesus. Look how useful that is. Look how powerful that is against humans. Just one short burst and he's dead. He's barbecue. He's gonna heal quickly. Get ourselves the full health, give ourselves as much chance to not die as possible. Let's get the flamethrower, keep that out. Let's loot this guy's corpse. Maybe he's got some shotgun shells. He's got one. <laughs> we may as well load the shotgun up. Let's get the flamethrower back out. Alright, I think we're going this way. I don't think there's any more. Threats about. 
inspected. I don't know what the hell this is. They're not just responding to trespass violations, it's like they're hunting. Just <laughs> for everyone and anyone. What do you mean? Stand by. I mean, it is weird that they're just starting to attack all of a sudden. Alright, so we've got to go... Can we go left here and then go take a right? Let's see what our options are here. Did these doors open? Let me just quickly check this guy's corpse, because we are like, we're starting to need ammo now. Alright, we got them. There we go, we got some here. So let's try and loop these guys around. Oh, there's people here as well. Sounds like they're going to start shooting. Right, this door looks a bit locked. That's not good. I've got some security shutters in here. All right, this guy wants to fight. Wait. You bastards! You murdering bastards! Leave them alone! Stand down! Shit! Need to reload. He's gonna grab me! Ah, oh, shit! I thought I had three shots in the fucking gun. Need to reload it now. Maybe I can kill him with this last this last shot. Wait. Yes, boy. So obviously, if you can, you don't want to kill them because you want to conserve ammo for when you really do need to kill them. But uh, they take so many shots as well, it's so gay. The, I think revolver shots takes like 10 shots at least. I killed one earlier with the, with the revolver and it took a lot of kills. A lot of shots even. Find an alternate route. Right, is there a guide path to give the alternate route? I wonder as well if you can take down a synthetic with the uh, maintenance tool from behind, if you can just mash his brain in, you know? That'd be pretty handy if you could do that. Right. I'm trying to sprint just to get places quicker, but I think it does give your position away quite a lot. The good thing about this as well is we've actually got a lot of med kits and we can still craft quite a few more. So, taking damage isn't really an issue. And it's also, like, if you do take damage from a synthetic, they grab you, you can just... Shake him off. I'm gonna kill this guy because he's a dick. He's just gonna try and kill us otherwise. He's not dead. He's got armor on. That guy, that person there, doesn't look friendly either. What if that guy was a civilian? <laughs> he's dressed like he might be helpful. Oh, oh well, his, his, um, his life's over. Right, there's a person that ran over here. Okay, you're, you're not any bother. Because sometimes if you kill civilians in this game as well, it ends the game. Because it says, like, you, you shouldn't kill civilians. But you can't trust anyone. I mean, I've become them now. Do you know where they were shooting on sight of anyone they didn't know? And I was like, because that guy could have been friendly. <laughs> I'm just doing the same as what they were doing. I've become a douchebag. Right, there's a save point over there. Gonna, do we need to access this? I don't think we do. So it's going to um, save first before we do anything else. Alright, so there's a passageway to go this way. There's a door open. Oh, the edges of those doors, see the way they just open? They always make me feel like someone's jumping out on me. They just like peek out as soon as the door opens. Alright, let's get that shit. Um, so, what have we got for weapons? We've got a revolver, flamethrower, that's it really. Flamethrower is a pile of shit against synthetics as well. Alright, oh, what? Oh, come on, mate. Really? Is he coming? He's coming. Let's take him around this, this, this desk. Come around this side. Come on, keep going. Good boy. Let's go. <laughs> See ya. Please open the door quickly. Alright, which way are we going? I'm going the wrong way. It's, I always do that. I always go the wrong way as soon as I'm in a rush. So I'm just going to run as fast as we can. I just want to help. No, you don't. Look at them. They're fucking doing reset, reverse psychology now. These guys are getting smart. Are we going that way? Shit, I'm cornered. Um, shit, I'm corn cornered again. Oh, I should have went a different way. Oh, can I climb up? Let me climb up, please. No. Oh, they just take that like nothing. Oh, what a dick. Alright, let's just smash his face. Now he's on fire. Alright. Alright, let's figure out where we need to go. I think it's up, right? Is there a door there we need to go into? I need to keep checking this. Is it there? Right, it's in here. Alright, if we can find somewhere to hide, if we get out of sight, that would be really nice. Alright, 
Okay. So where are we going? Where are we going? We're going this way. Let's do a little shimmy shimmy around these boxes. Let's go back up, up, up the platform. I think the guy's right behind me, isn't he? Oh, he's going to come alive if I step too close. Did we just come this way? Oh, there's a, there's a vent, there's a vent, there's a vent, get in the vent, get in the freaking vent! Yes! We made it! Together we made it! Whatever the words are. I didn't start the fire! Well, I did actually. <laughs> I didn't find it too impressive, so we'll heal up there. Let's quickly uh, make some med kits. Alright guys, I just made some med kits, and I also made a EMP mine. I've got two of them now, so they could be pretty useful, I guess, against the... Um, Synthetics, they blow them up. Never tried one. I'll try it next time we encounter one, I guess. Saves using like five shotgun shells or 12 pistol rounds. Alright, so we're going this way. Alright, we're in um, the bureau now. That was a good little route to take. Is everyone still alive? Oh shit, there's bodies. There's bodies. <sighs> Fantastic, let's see him save the game. <laughs> So Taylor and Samuels probably are no longer here. They're either dead or they escaped. Something tells me they're dead. Just because, you know, the state sat Taylor was, oh, this guy's alive. He's just sitting there like nothing's happened. Dude. Rip. Rip, they're all dead. The Android slaughtered them. Why? Why the fuck? Was I don't know, but I think Samuels does. Samuels? Why? Wait sent him to access Apollo. I need to find him. Have you seen Taylor and Marlo? No. No. They're not here. I think they may have got clear. Ricardo. Ricardo! If I go after Samuels, can you run this place? I need eyes and ears. I'm not fucking staying here. Ricardo, I need you to do this. Can you man the station and keep me covered? Ricardo! Yeah, sure. Of course. Sit tight. Lock the fucking doors and don't let anyone in. Look after me. I'll come back for you. Alright, before we go out there, I'm just gonna quickly um, do a bit of stock up on ammo. All these dead bodies and shit. Alright, let's go. So we're taking the transit again to the skimmer tower. Just when you get rid of one threat, the alien. The freaking synthetics become super dangerous. Oh, I just made some noise and he's made. He's coming for it. There we go. Hello. Hello. Let's, um, let's just try and use the um, EMP mine. Place it. Oh god, I'm doing this wrong. I'm doing this so wrong. Let's place. Hold to place. I'm gonna wait, wait, wait. Oh, EMP. Has that killed him? Stunned. Can we melee him? Get, get wrecked, bitch. Just keep smashing him. That's gonna kill him eventually, surely. Oh, nice. So EMP, uh, electric magnetic pulse. I didn't even read. I knew it said mine. I didn't think I thought it was gonna be explosion for some reason. But that's actually pretty useful. They're, they're really expensive to make, though. That's the only problem. I just wanted to test it out on that guy, seeing as he did spot us. So, we are heading through these doors. Alright. Is this a map update we can pick up here? No. It's a box we can open. Alright, I'm going to try and actually stealth past some of these synthetics now, because I keep sprinting. And they're obviously hearing me before I even go in the room. There's one around the corner. Is he, is he walking this way? He's walking away. I wonder if I can just do what I just did, you know what I just melee'd? I wonder if I can do that from just sneaking up behind them. If you can, that's pretty good. As long as you're one-on-one, -on -one, you can take him out. Let's try that. Why not? YOLO! Oh no, that didn't work. That didn't work. <sighs> I should have sneaked past them. I think we can still get past them. Actually, we've gone the wrong way now. Let's take him for a little walk. Walkies! Oh, just one there. Nice. Alright, so we need to get to the the, um, the lift and turn it on. Go for skimmed, this one. Skimmed tower, core transit. 
Now we need to kite these guys around for a little bit <laughs> while we wait for the transit car to come. Don't run. Alright, we've got plenty, plenty of space to play with these guys now. You know guys, I used to be a hardcore raider in World of Warcraft and I always got to give them the kiting jobs, so I should be alright with this. <laughs> and just the only thing that concerns me right now is there's only one of them. Where's the other guy? I'm going to catch you. <laughs> I'm going to catch you. Where is he? There he is. Right, come this way. Is the door open? There he is. The door should be opening, right? Where's the other guy gone? That, that is my only concern right here. So we, we are going to skim a tower. Yes, we are. This is fun. Oh, he's getting closer. Oh. Umpen, umpen, umpen. Is it umpen? It's umpen. Ta-da! <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> Alright, so we're at Skimmed Tower. I think. Are we looking for Samuels now? We have no objective at the moment. Let's just step out and see what it says. Rick, do you hear me? Clear. I can see activity on terminals on the top levels of seeds and synthetics. Rip, I'm not sure I can do this. Ricardo, I need you to focus. You're in charge now. In charge? In charge of what? A room full of dead people? This is fucked up! <laughs> Yeah. Focus, Ricardo. If Samuels can talk to Apollo, he can get the androids to stand down. Then this will all be over. Let's save the game. So Samuels is now in Seeks and Synthetics. He knows some shit that we don't know, and he's keeping it secret from us. Right, Seeks and Synthetics is behind us. I think we've been here before. So hopefully not a lot has changed since we last been there. <laughs> Apart from the androids being in killing machines, of course. Okay, I need to stop sprinting, because obviously these synthetics now are just walking around. These average Joes. Alright, we've been here before, definitely, do you remember? Yeah. It's all coming back to me. And, okay, this is where we met the guy in the hospital, right? Up there, yeah, that lift up there, that led towards where we met the guy who um, was going to give us the medical supplies. And he ended up getting his own face eaten off by the alien. In the process. Okay, I'm on the wrong side. We'll go on this side. Yep. This is the elevator. What the hell has that guy got hanging out his mouth? With me. There's a security alert firing off in the labs nearby. Elevators are out. Looks like the seats and synthetics aren't taking kindly to a wailing Utani model snooping around. So how do I get up? You have to climb. There's a service vent through to the elevator shaft around there somewhere. He's got a magazine rammed down his throat. Does the synthetic do that? I wouldn't think they'd be that, like, precise with something. You know, if you just mashed the face in, wouldn't get a magazine. Alright, so if you can find something to cut through the panel, the code is 8382. Don't worry if not, I'm coming back down for you now. So there's a code we can use there, 8382. Alright, have we got any save points up here? We've got one across the other side. But we need to climb the elevator shaft. There we go, so the code's going to be used behind this door. Right, so I think the um, the code he said was eight three eight two. I just completely gone blank for a second. Eight three eight two. Sounds familiar. Yeah. All right. So we can climb through these shafts. This is something to pick up there. There's a flare. We never ever use flares. I don't really know what the point of them is. Obviously to brighten the room up, but it's never that dark where you can't see, and you just use your flashlight anyway. I guess you could distract someone with it. All right. So someone's come across here before. There's a ladder put there. Um, pick up this bonding agent. Okay, and climb the ladder. Oh, that's wonky. That's wobbly. Oh shit! Make it! Make it! Yeah, boy, we made it. <laughs> Any 
closer. Oh, what an explosion that is. It's gonna cause some attention. Oh, God, okay. So is this gonna open? Or oh, we need to climb higher? Let's climb up here. And now, for my next trick, we're gonna go inside this gap. The scare factor has actually gone quite a bit in this game right now because the alien. I mean, the synthetics are never that scary. You just, if someone sees you, you go, "Oh shit, he see me." There's no like just jump scares with them or anything that we haven't already seen. There we go. Open. No, no. You gonna open? There we go. <laughs> got there in the end. What have we got in here? Not a lot. There's some synthetics lying down the ground. They could come alive if we step over them. That one's got no lower body though, so I don't think he's gonna be a threat. Uh, that one. That one's a different story. Let's go on this side. Uh, oh, come on! That is bullshit. He wasn't even facing that way. I went past his legs and he grabbed me. So, time to heal. There's no issue though. We've got loads of health packs and loads of potatoes to craft more. Let's continue. Ricardo, okay. oh. I'm here. Looks like the place synthetics go to die. <laughs> so this is like where they make synthetics, it looks like. Oh, don't do this to me. He, he's like malfunctioning, this one. Right, there's a save point there. We're going to go to that save point. Let's get on this before that guy wakes up. <laughs> Hostiles nearby. No shit. Alright guys, we're going to actually end the video there, so thanks for watching, see you next time, bye!